18. And Robles shortens to third base. Hit a 1 0. Yeah, he's on the attack, right, with the hard stuff. And I think it's been something that has worked for him. And if all in, in commanding it on the edges of the strike zone. The old one. Yeah, that one missing. Luis Garcia at 290. So you like me six. He is a hard guy to walk. Line drive and a base hit out into right field as Suzuki collects it. Here's Luke Voigt now. Yeah, the power hitting first baseman takes a strike. It's, it's Chicago, I guess. Yeah. There's no other Wrigley Field. I... And that one in the dirt and kicks past Contreras. And Keegan Thompson will grab it. A wild pitch. And down to second goes position for Voigt. Boom on Sadies. And a big swing and a miss from Luke Voigt. Later innings, Cubs have had some struggles scoring runs. You may see a little more hit, run, small ball. Cubs and Nationals in ground ball percentage. One and three in ground. One, one. On the ground, backhanded, Horner, right there, stands. And there's a disturbance in the forest. Got Chubby, Rod Comer. Yeah, you see that? They're protecting. We're going to go with that. Is there a lightsaber, right? Thompson goes inside and misses. 2 <laughs> 1. Yeah, that pitch missed. So now three balls at a strike. Foul tip into the mid of Wilson Contreras. Keegan Thompson, his last time out at St. Louis. Shift is on. Foul ball. Will Horner wisdom on the right side in that order. 3 2. Through the middle, just kind of a ground ball, but beat the shift. Right at Morrell. and coming up but then instead of staying on top of the baseball as he starts to deliver you know you get that he throws across the diamond and it's a heater there's no doubt about that so we'll take a look watch his throwing arm it's up now it goes down and the ball just takes off up high and you, yeah you throw that two seamer and it can either go straight down to the dirt <laughs> memories. bad memories <laughs> Felt the glove actually touch the jersey. Check swing, called strike. I'm throwing. I would go out there then, and I would take many ground balls as I could and make my throws every single day. Hey, Thomas here. No score, just get going. John Chomby, Ron Coomer with you. Third, the foul. I, you know, just to finish off in terms of your time with that, my perception. Roll it over there, right. Coom. Just roll yeah. it over. That I am 100% sure it was just that simple. One out man at first, one, two. And a swing and a miss. Thomas is gone. And with the strikeout, there's two. Hernandez fouls one off. Hernandez and very intense. They want to win. In the air, left field, shallow, half in and towards the left. But the game does not become official and was halted in the third inning because of a fierce thunderstorm. And then he known that it wouldn't resume, he would have joined them on the tarp. Can't blame him. That was great. Craig Maddox and the fellas <laughs> head first across the tarp. <laughs> Love it. Michael Franco now. 
Nothing like having your starting pitchers out. Doing it this year. I can't remember where it was. Real pitch gets popped up. Foul ground. This is a Nationals team that's 14th in the league in yeah. runs per game. They just let you know the nine hitter when you play getting the green light. Drilled out towards right center. Suzuki. Sit down. It is amazing to me, and then I think part of that has something to do with the approach and how things have been taught. It's affected the offense. Right field, Suzuki started back now at the break. That'll go down as one of the lowest right. in the last. And I don't think you can dismiss it. That's made it a lot harder. And I think, you know, pitchers just got wiser, but. You guys, the hitters, you do not get your auto fastball in count. This thing is a fastball count anymore. Absolutely. So you agree. don't get your 2-0 fastball, your 3-1 fastball. You don't get it. What he's doing in certain counts. And you can you get all that info. Place to center, but right at Ortega. Good boy, who came over in the one Soto trade. In the zone to him, he can hit it a long, long way. This is the, the best. Can you throw enough fastballs and stay at the top of the zone enough against him? Or do you make the mistake and does it come? Here comes a 2 1. On the ground at right at Madrigal. Gobbles it up to the left. Of monitoring how far he goes. I think right now they're just going to keep running him out there, keep utilizing all the different mechanisms they have to measure, to test, to see is there fatigue. They'll have their eyes out or open for it, but. Yeah. There's a, for the last month, say month and three weeks or so. And I would have someone learning how to pitch through the end of the season because your goal is. Yep. And so there's there's that mental side of that part of part of the game of being able to play an extra month. Base hit off the bat of Nelson Cruz. First time. Chop to the right side. And Kramer thought about going to sack back in 2015 out of Venezuela. They signed him for 140,000. On the ground to the right side. Magical moves it up over to Wisdom. And Thompson able to. Against Keegan Thompson. Side and that hit him. Yeah, they got him. You got it. Just in case. Sting. Once in a while, someone's coming up and in on me. Okay, you get a heater up here. No, I'm aware of that. I and then JD it. will go sneak attack up and in. Ooh, maybe in the same shot. Yeah, yeah, might need the elbow. Hernandez. Yeah, good pitch right there. Very effective. Saints. It's a big baseball card collector and football card. Played in Birmingham and Huntsville. And you talk about now. I was a minor Dame fans. Mm. <laughs> right field, Suzuki sliding in, and he can't make the play. But quickly unloads to second. And Wrigley Field. If it's not the toughest, it's one of the top. One, two, or three in the league. Yeah, Wrigley and Fenway. Yep. And the little nuances of playing right field in Wrigley. Trevor's <laughs> able to stop that one. Just missed the missed the ball. Outside corner. Uh huh. Three two on the ground. Corner. Magic. Wisdom. Three good plays to turn a double dip. Check swing at a foul.
that's the biggest. It's tough to work on by yourself in, in, in the gym. It just doesn't work out that way. Thompson with the strike at 6 Eastern, 5 Central on Fox. People will come from most definitely come. And we got Pat and I. We are coming. That's right. There. Thursday. Looks good. Really does, doesn't it? That's a great setting. Nothing but good things from some of our colleagues in the broadcast world that did the game last year. Yeah, they did a really nice job. In Iowa, played for the Cubs, Matt Dermody. <laughs> He's no dummy. <laughs> The old one <laughs> is downstairs. Let's see, how many buttons does Luke Boyd have done there? <laughs> that up on the scoreboard, how many buttons, I don't know whether it was how many will be done or undone. This one is blasted out to right center, and he has undone one here. A button popping swing, and the Nationals on the board 3 1, and for Boyd, home run number 15. Good juice out towards right center field. And in four years, is doing 883, and you're like, I really like our first baseman. That's to center or take that. In the air out towards right center or take that. Oh boy.